Hi friends, this is my three month results videos to show my progress on my journey so far. When I have reached my goals, I will make long form videos to explain every step I took, answer questions and share my thoughts and ideas. But for now, I'm just uploading these shorter videos so I have a record of my progress, which helps keep me motivated. Everyone has been so supportive and kind on my daily shorts videos and in these results videos. So I'd like to thank everyone who has stopped by and left a nice comment or a thumbs up or subscribe to show their support. I wasn't expecting anyone would even see my videos to begin with, so it's been a pleasant surprise to have so much support along the way so far. I am not focusing on a specific goal weight, but rather on being firmly within the healthy BMI range. When I started this journey, my BMI was 34.5, which put me at risk of many obesity related illnesses. I was having a lot of joint pain, heart palpitations, I felt sick all the time and was very uncomfortable in my clothes because even though they fit, there were always places where they were too tight and would pinch me or restrict my movement. By the end of April, my BMI has reached 26.4, which is getting very near the green range. Remember, just being a healthy BMI doesn't mean you're healthy. You need to have plenty of exercise and fresh air, nourishing food, and try to avoid excesses of things that may not serve your body like processed food, stress, and alcohol. These are all things I am working on to try to change my lifestyle and habits so that I can be healthier moving forward. A lot of people ask about my food, so here is a compilation of some of my favorite meals. I have written an explanation by each clip, so you can pause if you want to read more about it. I try to mostly have meals made from whole foods that I have prepared myself, and I only eat things that I love and will enjoy immensely. Rather than changing what I eat, I'm focusing more on eating less, as in the past I always ate in excess at every meal, which was not serving my body and was a lot more than I needed. I do not count calories because for me personally that would be too stressful, though counting calories can be helpful for many people. Instead, I am using intermittent fasting and smaller meals to help me reach my goals. I will explain all of this in a lot more detail, with recipes if people want them, when I have reached my goals. I'd like to thank everyone again for all the support you have given by liking, subscribing or leaving a kind comment. Remember to be kind to yourself as well. Namariye. No